Hello families and friends of yours from across the world. First of all, allow to introduce myself for those who don't know me. Joey Jones here. Pleasure to meet you guys. Thank you for watching. Subscribers, I appreciate your support. Thank you for subscribing. You want to know more? Subscribe. At the end, subscribe. Two thumbs up like always. I appreciate your support again. I appreciate your help. First of all, Today I have a new video for you guys today, something different. And this video is for all musicians, vloggers, um, movie makers, party poopers, party makers, <laughs> etc. Today I'm bringing in this video and we're going to be unboxing the new Sony HDR MV1. So we're going to do an unboxing and we're going to put it to the test to see how good it is. I heard a lot of good things about it and I heard a couple of bad things about it. So let's get to the good part. Then we'll talk about the bad later. Okay? So stay tuned, guys. We'll see you in a few. Okay, guys, this is what I have here. I have the new Sony HDR MV1. Okay, so this is a musician's um, camera and also for uh, vloggers and. Um, those who want to create uh, videos and pick up sounds. Um, first of all, this camera here has uh, uh, the, the XY mic, which are uh, the condensed mics, which picks up just about anything in the room. If it's out of the room, it won't pick it up. But um, that's what brought my attention. And it's so small, it's portable. And well, let's get started to see what's in the box. So right now, um, it's a nice decent box. And um, of course, we're gonna start with the instructions. And Sony, thank you for your purchase, of course. Yep, you get that, and of course you get ideas. They give you ideas of what else can you get from them. And let's see what else I have here. Of course, it's the, the instruction booklet. Pretty much you just follow the instructions and pretty much Gives you step by steps, the batteries, how to how to connect to the laptop, and um, and of course um, this right here, you must have a desktop or a laptop to charge it. It, it charges with USB. Okay, so let's get further in there, and of course the warranty, the Sony warranty, and what else we have here. Of course, more things to, yep, uh, consumer one year warranty. I guess if it breaks or something, you send it back to Sony or the store. Well, sometimes the store doesn't want you to send it back to them. They always want you to send it back to the manufacturer. But these days you can just send it back to the, to the, um, to where you purchased it from. Well, I purchased it from Sweetwater.com and they're reliable. They, they have good stuff and there's a lot of competition out there. But um, but these little um, uh, musicians ca uh, video cameras. So this is more to it. Um, digital HD video camera recorder. Pretty much, it gives you an explanation. It pretty much explains what's the start button, power button, the lens cap, the cap strings, in detail. And then of course the SD card. It's an SD mini card, and you can uh. It goes up to 32 gigabytes. Okay. 32 gigabytes for the mini SD card. I think that's the highest you can go on it. And, um, and okay, this, this, wow, the screen resolu resolution is 1920 by 1080, 30 frames per second. And that's, that's really good for a small camera like this. It's, 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 it's really good. Okay, let me see what else I have here. It's a hard plastic box and there it is. You can pull it out there. And there it is. Yep. Well, yep, it has the more stuff to it, the batteries, of course. We'll get to that later. And then of course, I guess the slot there. So you can put the battery, of course. Put the battery, and then on the back, you have the multi-slot. Where you open that up, 
you can put your head, headset there and then you can charge it there or HDMI out or you can add an extra microphone to the red slot there if you want an extra microphone say you um a labial microphone or a, a wireless uh, microphone uh, with the transmitter you can also do that too and let me just remove this here that's just to protect the screen of course and the screen is a 2.7 screen here with the playback button and then the scroll and those are the mics that's what brought my attention what brought my attention was the microphones these are two XY condensed microphones and they pick up just about anything in the room okay so what brought my attention was the microphones and and the focus lens it has a Carlsys lens on it and this right here it's a widescreen lens so if you're in a wide room it's gonna pick up just about anything in the room normally these cameras they'll just it's, it's, it fits to just to capture you but this one is a widescreen view we're gonna put it to the test later on in the video so this right here has the little plastic mount you have to remove that bolt hopefully that can remove one from, yep comes off easily okay here it is let me put the battery of course it only brings one battery and it's a lithium ion NP okay here it is the battery is a lithium ion NPBX1 it's a 3.6 volt okay it's a type X you can always you can get a set of these at eBay Amazon or any um okay here we go put this here put the slot in got the battery in doesn't bring an SD card but I want to say that I opened this earlier I charged it and I added an SD card to it as you can see but it does not bring an SD card and I'm just using a 32 gigabyte SD card on it right now 2.7 screen is a 230k wide video clear and it's it, ha, it, it and it's a photo LCD and it records on 16.9 HD is a HD video camera specified designed for music video productions in up to 1080p and 30 frames per second is a wide angle car zeus vario tazar lens and a sony exmor r cmos sensor wow interesting and then it, it lasts it's about once you charge it, it it'll last you 3.5 hours okay so the usb cord open the slot plug it in the back and there it is and then you'll plug it into your laptop to get it charging right now it's fully charged because I open like I said I opened it and I, and I charged it just to do this review because I'm gonna put it to the test we're gonna put it to the test soon so basically what else is in the box and um pretty much what it is and uh, let me see if I can fire this thing up okay here it is I'm gonna click on the menu Okay, and of course um okay uh, recording mode you have a recording mode you have a playback function you have edit copy camera audio image quality setup image quality let's see what happens is at 1080 of course and um, the playback button of course pretty interesting little speaker there on the side so you can play back and um, another thing is that I want to show you is that I have um I have the gorilla pod I have a mini gorilla pod that you can screw it on there and then you can just set it on the ground pretty much set it on the ground and there you go 
you can just record anywhere just about anywhere but yep you could put a little gorilla pod or a, a tripod start record stop record power on power off and that's pretty much it but yep everything is through this dial here you gotta press it down and then you see the options and the controllers and of course the playback button and you have the you can control the uh, that's the volume the recording volume is all the way up and the Wi-Fi and you can uh, turn on and off the microphones you can adjust it there let me see adjust it you can adjust the microphones level it there yep it's interesting and of course the Wi-Fi and let me show you the Wi-Fi how that works I um I actually um went ahead and, and did that I went ahead and set up everything so I'm bringing in my cell phone and you just have to put in type in play memory you type in you type in play memories remote the app it's already installed so you open it okay so then you gotta come here you gotta come here and then you tap on Wi-Fi tap on Wi-Fi and now we're searching they're searching you click on the app and now it's, it's, it's yep searching connecting I'm just gonna set this down so I can pretty much show you how it works and then I'm already connected yes I am so there it is so there it is I'm actually have the app I downloaded the app and there it is once you download the app then you can take full control from your cell phone or your iPhone and there it is all you have to do is just um, connect it to the Wi-Fi download the play memories app um, again um, click on click on the Wi-Fi which is already connected and then search for the um search for the camera on your phone click enter and that's it you're in so then the record button all you have to do is just press record from your phone so you don't have to actually reach over and hit the record button here you know that's what that is I mean which is a pretty pretty it's a really good option it's a pretty nice option okay so um but yep there it is now we're gonna put it to the test okay we'll see you in a few well guys there you have it right now is recording live with the Sony HDR MV1 and I'm remote recording it with my cell phone by just one tap away one app away on your iPhone or your Android phone okay guys so there you have it is the Sony HDR MV1 it's a value cost at $299 you can probably get it for a little less at Amazon or eBay I got mine from Sweetwater and they give you um, two year support um, tech, um, tech support and warranty any problem you can send it back to send you a new one so that's why I always buy from Sweetwater.com okay so um so yep that's it right now I'm seeing everything that everything you're seeing I'm seeing it right now on my cell phone which is really cool because when you're playing with your band you don't want to run over there to the camera and press and then press the stop record so just do it manually from your phone all right guys please subscribe thank you for watching we'll see you next time later guys